Our Navy remains a symbol of the United States, of our dedicated and skilled sailors, of our technological genius and our massive but controlled military strength, which patrols the oceans of the world on a mission of peace. Named after the 38th President, Gerald R. Ford, who served in the Navy during World War II, USS Gerald R. Ford is the Navy's newest carrier and carrier class. Undoubtedly, the, the foremost event that led to uh, Gerald Ford joining the Navy uh, and enlisting in the Navy was the Japanese attack on Pearl Harbor and the U.S. declaration of war in Japan. He commissioned as an ensign on 13 April 1942 and in short order was promoted to Lieutenant JG on the 2nd of June 1942. And then later in March of 1943 uh, received a, another a promotion to Lieutenant. Interestingly, President Ford probably had two very significant factors and experiences that he was able to apply in his career as a, as a Naval officer. The first was the fact that he was a Boy Scout he, in fact, is the only president to have ever been an Eagle Scout. And the other thing was his experience as a football player at the University of Michigan. His experience with athletics was important because when he was first commissioned in the Navy, he was brought in as a training officer, and he would ultimately serve as an athletics coach as well as an instructor of navigation and gunnery. Ford's naval service is indicative of his generation in that they answered the call to service, performed their duties honorably, and then went on to live a life that was of merit through his political career, both as a member of the House of Representatives, ultimately as Vice President and President. As the newest class of aircraft carrier, USS Gerald R. Ford will continue Ford's legacy as an asset to the fleet.